All right, so what I want to do is make a second video for Quran chapter 2, verse 109. And the reason being is because I want to focus on showing how you need to know English to know the Quran, which is going to be the title of this video. So to show this, what I'm going to do is use Yusuf Ali's translation from 1985. And I'm going to focus on this word infidelity right here. And infidelity is used in Quran chapter 2 verse 109. And infidelity is being translated from the Quranic Arabic in this verse that in part says kufiran, which essentially means kafirs, or for the English word, disbelievers. But instead of disbelievers, Yusuf Ali uses the English word infidelity. That generally means a spouse cheats on a spouse. So for the common English speaker, when they read quite a number of the people of the book wish they could turn you people, the believers in Prophet Muhammad, back to cheating on your spouses makes no sense whatsoever. But here's the brilliance with English. Yusuf Ali uses infidelity because infidelity means you know you have a spouse and you know you are cheating on your spouse. Just like a Kafir knows they have a creator and knows they are cheating on their creator. So that is my quick take on how you need to know English to know the Quran, which is from Quran chapter 2, verse 109. And what I'm going to do is put a picture right here. And what I would like you to do is click that picture and subscribe. And I'll see you next video.